Hello folks, here we have an inkdependence.com water drip test of Online's Brown Ink. Not a particularly interesting name, but brown it is. This is a quite uh, brown ink. You're going to get a lot more of the brown. You can actually see it's looking there. A little bit chocolatey, a little bit delicious on the page. It's going to look different from some of the other browns that tend to have a bit of, uh, I don't know, a bit of yellow in them even. Sometimes a little bit of red. Well, I guess this one tends more toward red than yellow, I suppose, if you're going to get down to the basic color in there. Uh, it is quite a nice brown ink. It's a little bit wet uh, in terms of flow, so that's going to be good for you if you've got a sort of fine tip pen. This was cut from my Rotring Core, which is marked XS, uh, but if any of you have used the Rotring Cores before, you know that XS really kind of means, I don't know, a medium fine. It's not particularly fine. It's not exactly medium. It's somewhere in between. It's certainly not extra small. I don't know why it's marked XS, but they are. Uh, this one flows really nicely out of this pen, however. I left it in there for quite a long time. I used up uh, pretty much all of my sample, actually, and this is um, a sample that I'm not going to be able to get a hold of any other, any more for, from, uh, for a while. They used to sell online inks over at Goulet Ink, which is where I, I picked up the sample, but it appears they don't sell them anymore. They used to come in little tiny bottles. You really kind of needed a syringe in order to get to the ink inside, but... Uh, nonetheless, this is quite good ink. I actually like it a lot. I've got a black and a red sample I need to try out soon. Let's see what's going on. We put some water on here. <laughs> Apparently what's going on is that all of the ink is coming off. It actually kind of makes an attractive little swirl there. It's not going to stick around on the page, though. So if you're looking for a water-resistant brown ink, this is not your ticket. In fact, I actually don't think I have any water-resistant browns exactly. So that was, yeah, it totally comes off. Now, granted, this is rhodia paper, so it's not going to soak in much. This stuff is coated pretty well, and uh, it's fantastic paper. In fact, if you look at the back of it, it's, uh, I had that water sitting there for quite a while. It's totally dry on the back. Uh, so this has been Online's Brown Ink. I definitely suggest you try to find Online Ink if you can somewhere. Uh, their website might have it, although the German language website seems to be the only side of it that works. It is a German ink. I don't speak German as well as I ought to in order to find... Uh, uh, my way around their website, but the English language site looks like it's been uh, out of commission a little bit. So good luck finding some online ink, but uh, if you can, snag up a little tiny bottle of this stuff and uh, use it. It's great.